Hello everyone, uh, Sensei Roy O'Kane here and I'm joined today by... Reese. Way. And today we're going to be doing the roundhouse kick. Mawashi Geri. Mawashi means to come round. Geri means to kick, as in my Geri, Yoko Geri, Ashiro Geri. Mawashi Geri. Mawashi Geri is a commonly used kick in competition. It's the most commonly used kick and certainly capable of winning outright with a nip on and there are different ways to do mawashi geri and we're going to cover some of those today but the basic principles as we do any kick we'll start from the very beginning so front, uh, front stance this way so kamai arms up now because it's the kick's coming round round the way we lift up to the side so we still pull the heel in the heel in and up like we would with my Gary, but it's coming round to the side like this, okay? So if we do it this way, so round, and then the supporting foot rotates 90 degrees to the left. That, see that? Now this, stay there, balance. This, I'm gonna show you Reese's knee, is where our knee and our foot are meant to be. This knee should be just above that foot. You don't want to be anywhere else. You certainly don't want to turn round further than that. And you don't want to be round this way towards me. That's uncomfortable, right? Just to the side, okay? Hold in that position and go back. So when we drive our knee up and lift it round, our arms change like this. H. Up to that position there, okay? This is balance. Allows us to balance here. We're just there. If anything goes wrong with this kick, also allows them to say block and then strike. So he's in a ready position. What's really important is we keep our back straight above this leg as much as possible. This line here. We don't want to be leaning. Okay. And we don't want to be leaning forward. Okay. The reason for that is if he's leaning backwards, oh, yes, yeah, just lean back. It doesn't, just lean back a little bit more. doesn't take any, uh, hardly any pressure from me this way, okay? So from here, if he's in this leaning position, all I would need to do is, in theory, is just go like this. But if he's forward, it means this is driving in, driving round. So from here, the next stage to the kick is to bring it round. Comes round to here. We practice with ball of the foot for outside. Maybe not outside. I don't know how many times I've walked down the street on my bare feet. But this is much more damaging for dojo. This part here, okay? This part here. So, and go back. So stage one, lift to the side. Bring it round. Kick. Recoil. Good, really important. And square up and then land. Okay? We don't just let our foot drop. So from here, just my washi get it and then just let it drop. That's not cool. Round, kick, bam. Oh, and then down, okay? Just that way, okay? Round and kick, and then down, that way. Same with my Gary, because I know you've watched the my Gary video. You better have, that's the, that's the homework, right? The height to which he lifts the knee is the height that I'm gonna kick, or he's gonna kick. So if he wants to kick, say here, sorry, that way, okay? This way, really painful. He lifts to that height. Then go. Oh, you do it harder than that. Go. Go, go, go on, go on. Oh, right. Okay. If he wants to come round here, he lifts to that height. Okay? And then back again. But if he wants to come to here, he's got to lift to that height. Okay? The height to which you want to kick. So we've got Jodan, Chudan, sorry, Gedan, Chudan, and Jodan, the different heights. Recap, we lift up to the side, bring it round, we kick, we recoil, balance can pose down. This is Mawashi Yeri. It can also be done with the front leg, same principle, if I'm here, he lifts and kicks, this way, go up, this way, okay, up, go. that way. All the time, we've got to keep the body over the leg. Around. Okay. No leaning back, no leaning forward. We lean back, we've got a problem. 
The same as my Gary, the first part of this kick has got to be fast. If it's slow, this will happen. Go. Okay? If it's slow, you're going to telegraph it to your opponent, they're going to see it, and then they're going to go. And they will hit you before that knee has even come round. This lift has got to be so fast that by the time I see the knee, I've already been kicked. Let's close to it again. Oh, good. So, speed in the start, pivot, round kick, back, and then down. You can, you can practice Mawashi Gary, you can practice it 50 times, left, right. But there are different ways to practice which makes it slightly more intensive. So, kick, then land forward. Turn. Kick, then land forward, two. Turn. Keep doing that. So we don't need a lot of space here. You'll all have that space at home. Okay? Similar to the my Gerry's. Now do two kicks. That's more intensive, right? We just change the volume, right? Fantastic. Five kicks. Excellent. And turn. That exercise there is largely work in balance. Yeah? Give me a number. Six. Six. Do six. Go. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then down. So that's another thing you can practice. The other thing is using some household props. I'm sure we've all got a chair at home. Okay? You can use the chair to make sure that we're lifting our knee as high as we possibly can. So for example, if, I'll just come in here. If I'm coming round and I'm not lifting high enough, I've got this striking action. But if I'm here and I'm lifting, I come round. Okay, so what you're gonna do is lift your knees slowly round to that position and hold. So you know that that height there is gonna result in a Jordan kick. If you cannot hold that position there or you find it quite challenging, just rest it on there. That's a stretch, okay? This could be the back of a sofa. How was your day? Good. Good. Any exciting news? No. No, okay. Uh, okay, that's it. We're stretching. You've all got a chair at home. This is my washi Gary position. Not like this. This way, yeah? Here like this. Everything forward. Okay? So, we need a seat now. That's Mawashi Gary. There's different ways to practice it. You can do it lots of different ways forward, back, multiple kicks on, uh, on one leg or the other. Keep working hard, keep up the practice, and uh, I look forward to seeing some outstanding Mawashi Gary's when you're back to the dojo. Awesome.